Republican leader Kevin McCarthy knew it would be an uphill battle. While the California Republican clearly campaigned for the speaker's gavel, he couldn't lock up the necessary support from within his own party, even as Republicans took back control of the House chamber. They placed the name of my friend and colleague from Arizona, Andy Biggs, for Speaker of the House. That formal challenge took enough votes away from McCarthy to send the House into a second round for the first time in a century. Ohio Republican Jim Jordan urged his party to rally around McCarthy. But another twist saw Matt Gates, a member leading the charge against McCarthy, nominate Jordan for the speaker position. I rise to nominate the most talented, hardest working member of the Republican conference who just gave a speech with more vision than we have ever heard from the alternative. I'm nominating Jim Jordan. A second and third round loss for McCarthy followed, with the chamber agreeing to adjourn until Wednesday. We may have a battle on the floor, but the battle is for the conference and the country, and that's fine with me.